I'm so excited. <laughs> Hi everyone. I know it's been a few days. I was at TwitchCon. I'm back. A couple important things have happened. Number one, City Skylines 2 came out. And also they've offered to sponsor us today, which is so exciting because I was gonna play this anyway. I think about City Skylines every single day of my life and the new one just came out and we're gonna play it today. And there's just a lot of fun, exciting things are happening. Also, um, I wore black nail polish this week and I took it off last night and it's kind of stained my nails. So they look dirty, ignore that. <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing. But it's it's because of the nail polish, okay? Um, yeah, hi, welcome back. We've got some life updates to share. We have some TwitchCon things to discuss. I was in Vegas for a few days. Um, I'm exhausted. <laughs> it's just been a lot. Vegas is, um, I think my, my final verdict on Vegas is that it was a terrible city for TwitchCon to be happening in. There's just too much going on. The construction in Vegas made it so hard to get around. It's like so not walkable. It's just like not, the vibes are off on Vegas for TwitchCon. The convention center in Vegas is really nice. But aside from that, I don't know, not so good for a convention. There's just too much, it's too much. <laughs> uh, but it's like not walkable, it's not drivable. They do have a like a monorail train, but even that is like, I don't know, it just was, Hard to get around there, um, which made it really difficult, but they haven't announced where next year's gonna be yet, no, Christine, but they will, I assume, soon. I was checking that, they announced this year's TwitchCon in February, so I don't know when they'll announce next year. Maybe in February again? I guess we'll see. Um, also, I'm home now, so I can see the cats again. Um, all the cats slept on my bed last night, which was fun. Um, to be honest, in the middle of the night, I kept waking up, and then I'd be like, oh my god, there's a cat there, but I couldn't tell which one it was. I felt kind of guilty. I was like, is that shrimp? Is that sunny? I don't know. It's on me and I can't tell because <laughs> I'm not used to having all these cats in the house and there's multiple kittens that are all black. Anyway, all three kitties on the bed yesterday. I have a couple pictures I want to show you um, of the cats from yesterday that were so, 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 so funny. Let me see if I can scroll back um, in my Discord DMs with hope so I can find something actually reasonable to show you, but <laughs> wait, you're gonna love this. Okay, so yesterday, um, Snap was sitting on the cat tree. Well, let me back up. So Sunny was sitting on the cat tree, right? And I don't know if Snap saw her at first, at least. So Snap went and like sat there on the tree and was just looking out the window. Um, and Sunny was like leaning down over it, staring at her. Um, and then <laughs> Snap realized that she was there and then started hissing at her. <laughs> I'm sorry, this picture is so funny to me. So funny to me. But she was fine for so long. Sunny moved, and then you couldn't see her anymore, and that's when Snap got upset. Like, as soon as Snap couldn't see her, she was like, where did you go? And got all mad, but look at the, I shouldn't, it's, I shouldn't laugh. Sunny's terrified, Snap is so mad. <laughs> anyway, um, so, Snap will tolerate them, but they are not friends, and Snap will make sure you know that. <laughs> Snap said, you are not my friend, Sunny. <laughs> I'll sit near you, but we are not friends. <laughs> anyway, so that was uh, yesterday. They were all on my bed last night, though. We slept together for a while. Snap doesn't usually stay in the bed all night, though. Snap, like, puts us to bed, and then she leaves, and then comes back in the morning. Um, that's one for framing, right? <laughs> Makes me feel so bad. Let me see, did I put a picture up on my Instagram story of them all in the bed last night? I did, hold on. I also posted here, look at this. You can see this picture too. This is everyone. That's my arm. That's Snap. Baby, baby. Uh-huh, isn't that so cute? <laughs> So that was that was yesterday. Things are going really well. Um, Snappy just likes to make sure that the kittens know don't get too close. And this is Shrimp constantly scooting as close as he can. He lays there and he like scoots a little more and then scoots a little more because Shrimp wants to be so close to her and she's like <sighs> unsure about it. So <laughs> you named your cat Shrimp because I couldn't find a name and I'm stealing your cat's name. Sorry. <laughs> don't worry. It's a good name. I don't mind. I don't mind. <laughs> I don't think shrimp minds either. 
Um, okay, so anyway, that's the cat update. Uh, at TwitchCon, I had a meet and greet. It went really well. I had a panel. Um, it went really well. There were no sharks that climbed on stage at the panel. So that was really exciting. Um, there were no dangerous disruptions. <laughs> uh, when I did the panel at VidCon, this guy climbed on stage uh, in a shark costume and was like being really weird and I thought he was gonna like do something bad. They didn't, so that was good. Um, <laughs> but there was nothing bad at TwitchCon. Um, nothing scary happened, um, so that was good. And uh, what else? I met a bunch of friends that I've known online for a long time in person. A lot of folks that I've like known for years I got to see again, like obviously I've seen Spring Sims a million times in person since like 2017. But for example, like Momo and Emrys, um, had never met them in person before. So I got to meet Momo and Emrys in person. We hung out like the whole weekend. Emrys got married. You will be so excited to know. All of you might know the name Emrys K from uh, our Among Us streams. Emrys got married, literally got married in Vegas while we were there. So that was so fun. Um, so, uh, there's sort of a long running joke that Emrys and Momo are married. They're not. They're actually married to separate people. <laughs> Um, Momo was already married and Emrys got married this weekend, so we were all there, so that was really cool. Um, but yeah, <laughs> so that was a fun uh, thing that we got to do. Um, I got to meet some people that I've admired for a long time. Um, like, I was in the car at the same time as Julian Solomita, and that was so cool for me, because I, like, look up to him so much. Um, and he was like, hey, you want to get a picture together? And we were in the party lounge, and I was like, you know who I am? <laughs> so that was really cool. I got to meet Julian. He's so nice. Um, Anyway, I also got to meet Cutie Cinderella, which, who I've also admired for a long time, um, and that was pretty fun. So it's just good. Oh, and and um, Gen X Pen also, I got to see her, so that was pretty cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. It was just really fun. Everything's just really fun. It was a good time at TwitchCon. Um, did I see Doc, like Dr. Gluon? Yeah, we hung out together like the whole time, pretty much. Um, us Sims folks, we tend to stick together at these things. Um, we <laughs> we sort of like hang around each other the whole time. Um, so that's always a good time. Anyway, I'm back now though. Um, I am back, I have returned, and we're gonna play City Skylines 2. <laughs> um, yeah, Sasha, Sasha and Steph were there. Steph didn't come last year, but she came this year. I realized yesterday, I am so dumb for this. Sasha and Steph have been my dearest, very bestest friends for like eight years, okay? We never remember to take pictures together. I got home and I was like, you guys, we did it again. <laughs> they were here at my house a couple months ago. We, we didn't take like any actual photos. We never take, we never like, hey, let's pause for a second and get like a picture taken of us. We never do. So I don't have, I have like some group, big group photos and like some ugly selfies. I have no real pictures from this weekend of me and Steph and Sasha. I never take pictures. I always forget, it's so silly. I'm so, so, so silly, but anyway, time for some Photoshop, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I'm so bad at remembering to get photos with friends. And then we go home and we're like, oh my God, you guys did it again. And then we'll say, we'll do it next time. And then we forget. <laughs> but anyway, um, we've been, yeah, I didn't have any pictures. That was kind of sad, but okay. Here's my life update about City Skylines 2. You guys, you know, you know how often I talk about City Skylines. It's like my favorite game literally ever to watch people play. I think that like city builders are so fascinating and cool. And the new one, City Skylines 2, just came out like today. Um, and we're gonna play it today. Uh, they're actually sponsoring our stream today, which is super cool of them. If you wanna check it out, I do have a link to, um, to the game in the chat and stuff. But uh, Vixella, <laughs> you should build the worst city ever, Las Vegas. Sasha, you know what? We were just talking about that. <laughs> I was just telling them too how we didn't get any pictures together this time, which is kind of sad, but anyway, Vegas, boo. What was I saying? Oh, right. So City Skylines is, is, um, is sponsoring the stream today, which is so fun of them. I love you, by the way, however, I was gonna play this anyway, bestie. <laughs> so if you wanna pay me to do it, by all means, I will not object. <laughs> um, so we're gonna make a new city today. I did play, so I played for like 45 minutes earlier cause I was trying to play through the tutorial so I would like know better. Um, and I also watched um, this one hour long YouTube video from my favorite YouTuber, City Planner Plays um, called The Ultimate Beginner's Guide to City Skylines 2. So actually I'll have you know I'm an expert cause I watched City Planner's play, City Planner Plays 
give me the ultimate beginner's guide. So now I'm ready. <laughs> I did my homework <laughs> and I'm prepared. Anyway, if you don't watch him, by the way, City Planner Plays is like my actual favorite YouTuber, like favorite YouTuber. I love City Skylines videos. <laughs> um, okay, and so we have to start a, a new city. I'm gonna maybe need some advice chat on what you wanna do and what you want it to look like so we can decide together. Um, Cause I'm not sure yet. Um, I played, I started my tester city in Lakeland. There's a place called Lakeland in Florida. So I felt a little bit, you know, like at home, but I might pick something different. But this is a big deal. Cause this is gonna change everything. This is like massive decision, serious business. I don't think I wanna be on like an archipelago. Barrier Island is intriguing. Great Highlands. I don't know. Potato City. You want me to call it Potato City? Mountain Village. I always used to think this kind of thing was so cool, but I kind of want to have more building space than that. Twin Mountain. Buildable area 39%. Hmm. River Delta. What about River Delta? I don't know. That's what you picked? Okay, I think I'm choosing between River River Delta or Mountain Village has like barely any buildable, buildable area, but I love the idea of a mountain village. Grassland plains in the midst of a mountain range. Water flowing from the hills creates a river valley in the center of the map with a breathtaking view in every direction. <gasps> no, there's more space. We're beginners, okay? We need to, let's, okay, next time, you know? Let's be real for a second. This isn't gonna be good. It's my first City Skylines 2 city. So let's pick something with like a lot of open space and then we can get fancy next time. Yeah. Shrimp City. <laughs> Maybe we should call it Shrimp City. No, I can't just name after one of my cats. I've played 20 minutes and your city is already a mess. Oh good, okay. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What if we picked Twin Mountains? No, God, you guys, I'm never gonna pick it. This is terrible. Sewer City? Ooh, let's call, okay, we can call it Sewer City. Sewer City. I like the idea of a European theme. No left-hand traffic. I, I, Guys, do I have to play with natural disasters? Because I don't want to. Did someone steal Lil Simsy? No, my name is Lil Simsy on purpose on Steam. I think it's funny. Um, so did no one stole my name? <laughs> no, I don't really want natural disasters. I don't think that's for me. I'm gonna keep that off. Okay, let's just start. Here we go. <laughs> also, can I just say, thank you all so much for the subs and bits and stuff since I went live. I uh, didn't stream for like five days, so I know a lot of you had resubs to share and I am so, 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 so unbelievable grateful, unbelievably grateful. So thank you so much for that. Um, you were, oh geez, you were all very generous. Okay, here is what we are working with today. Okay, interesting. Welcome to Sewer City, everybody. Maybe pause the game for a sec. It's pretty. I'm kind of excited. Okay. Okay. So here's what I know from City Planner Place. <laughs> Cause I watched, I watched a tutorial earlier. Um, <laughs> so I'm prepared. He said that he likes to get rid of the existing road grid and just do his own thing. Honestly, not opposed to that concept, but we'll see. Um, how does this game work? Oh, Bessie, it's a city builder. Um, so you build a city. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. Okay, other couple really interesting things about this game. If you played the previous City Skylines game, do you see how there's pipes and electricity in the roads? Is my stream lagging? I hope not. No? Okay. Um, but there's, there's pipes and electricity in the roads. So that makes things a little bit easier because I don't need to run it separately. Um, and I think I might try and work on building a slight road grid. We don't have a lot of space to work with here either. Yours is not lagging. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> the music is a tad loud, is it? 
I lost a few frames in the beginning of the stream, but it's fine now. Okay. Interesting. I'm not dropping any frames right now. Are we okay? I don't know. I think we should be fine. Yeah, I'd like to keep such as we can of the forest. I think that would be kind of cool if we could keep a lot of the forest. I sort of like that idea. I feel like that's kind of pretty. Um, do I want to have this highway here? I don't know. Sorry, you guys, I'm overwhelmed. I think I'm going to redo some of this grid. I think I want to start fresh a little bit. Kill the trees? Okay. <laughs> Okay, I don't know. I'm overwhelmed! Okay, sorry, 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 just play. This is why I can't play this game, because I, like, I think about it too much, you know? Maybe I should have done that differently. Hold on. What if we had the main road go kind of like, you know? Not the deforestation. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry, it's terrible. It's terrible. Do you think that's good? And we can build grids off of this somehow? I don't know. Doesn't really matter. We can experiment. It's like, it's everything is up to us. All roads, no plans. Looks like Vegas. <laughs> yeah, maybe it kind of does. Listen, I'm not Vegas' biggest fan right now, I must say. I must say. Okay, okay, everything's fine. What's this game about? It's a city builder. So you, um, you build cities. <laughs> Shockingly. Do, should I have, like, tried to size, like, size up these, um, grids a little bit better. Like, should I try and make them a specific size, or do you think it doesn't matter? No, I don't have unlimited money. I'm playing um, with no cheats right now, because I'm kind of curious to see, like, how it goes um, the first time I play to do it, like, sort of naturally, I guess. If it's gonna be Sewer City, are you gonna have Ninja Turtles references? No, I was more thinking Sewer like, like my cats. I think is more so what I was going for. Yeah, there's an auto grid tool, but I don't think I wanna use the auto grid. I think I'm more interested in um, like coming up with my own grid a little bit. Also, I don't know any Ninja Turtles references. I'm sorry, I'm not like, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, Christine, with the F1 construction in Vegas right now, it's so bad. <laughs> it's so bad. You can't, like, you can't take a car anywhere in Vegas. You just can't. It's really, really awful. Um, should I, like, I don't know. Not hip with the mutant turtles? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> I am not hip with the ninja turtles these days. Okay. Sorry guys, clearly um, I've messed up the grid somehow. But that's okay. We sort of know where the roads are going to go, so that's fine. Maybe over here we could try to like, I don't know, we'll see. Um, no, 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 no. Let me just think, okay? No judgment, okay? <laughs> Let me just, let me just think about it, okay? Um, um, okay, okay, okay. Okay. What are those blocks next to the road? It's places to zone. Um, it's like zoning locations. So uh, what we'll do eventually is we'll like zone in housing and stuff in those areas. I wanted to, before I started doing that, I wanted to get like a slight bit of, um, I wanted to get like a slight little bit of like a network, a road network going just so that I know what I want to do before we zone up anything just yet. 
Okay. Because I'm kind of nervous about it. No, that's too- I don't know, you guys. I should have planned it more. I don't know what I want it to be like. Should I get like a road that follows the river? I don't know. What kind of city and spot are we going for? I don't know! <laughs> we don't know yet! Right now we're going for a city. That's kind of the current situation, is just a city. We can always change parts of it later. Let me just start zoning, to be honest, because we have like a main road area, so we know what we're going to do. So this is fine. I'll just, if I have to bulldoze through some of their houses, then so be it, you know? City planner plays would have thought about this more. And I didn't. Cause I'll never be as good as city planner plays. Okay. Hi, <laughs> Fripa, thank you for the gifted subs, by the way. Okay, and then I was thinking, I was kind of picturing that on some of this main road, we would have a little bit of like, commercial stuff going on. And then most of this would be like more residential. I don't know, in there. You're bad at cities, but you enjoy it. Well, you don't, maybe you're just not good yet, you know? I don't think I'm that good at it, but I think it's cool, so. Oh God, okay, besties, hold on. We gotta start thinking about this water situation. So. Groundwater pumping station. How do you wanna get our water? Should we pump it? I don't know. Probably? Should I pump it from like over here? Yeah, I played a lot of City Skylines 1, Felix. Um, I don't ever think I was that good at it, but I played it. I think I'm gonna put this water pump down here. Should I? I don't know. You think more upstream, what than this? You want me to put it down here? Yeah, I guess I can dump the water there and I'll pump it from over here. Well, sewage over here, yes? I was gonna put the sewer over there, but maybe I shouldn't. Okay, let's build a road. Um. Should we put like... That's horrendous. If I just put a road like through this right now, will it let me? No. Slope too steep. Oh God. You guys. <laughs> oh, I didn't think this city through. <laughs> Uh, I don't want to have my main bridge over here, but I guess we're gonna have to. Okay, um, okay, 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 okay. That's too tall. Restart? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna restart, I'm fine. I'm so brave and fine. Okay, that's lovely. Yeah, we don't need to have, um, I saw people asking if there's no pipes. Uh, there are pipes, slope too steep, oh yikes. But the pipes in this game are, um, they're under the roads. So you don't need to have separate pipes because they're under the roads. Okay. Well, I'm, I guess, um, Okay, I guess over there is where we're gonna have industry stuff. Unless, mm, maybe we don't. Kayla Power, well the game is paused, Llama. <laughs> Hold on, <laughs> Hold on. It's fine, it's fine. Um, so maybe, what if we had like, 
Okay, what if we had like... Um... Slope too steep. Is that where the- oh my god, I should have tried to flatten this or something. Oh, you guys. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. Oh, and you have to think about the wind direction when you start planning industry stuff. I forgot about that too. Okay. You're back with Second Moon Radio. You're okay, we can't put the industry stuff over here. So settle back in your chair, pour yourself a glass, and prepare for another... <sighs> We won't spend too much money, don't worry. Oh. I won't talk over him. Okay, thank you. Thank you. And an aria inspired by the infamous Vivaldi shall be our guide. Okay, thank you. Anyway, I was thinking about doing this, this stuff over here, the industry stuff, but the wind blows that way. So maybe if I put industry stuff in here, it'll blow right into the forest. Also, I learned from City Planner Place today, we don't have to worry too much about um, overspending uh, with road networks. He said that it's like, you kind of have enough money that you can do some road planning in the beginning. So we're okay. I listen to City Planner Place because he knows everything. All right. So that's how we'll get over here, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Ooh. Really? Okay. Shella made a poo lake for her sewage. Oh, good. <laughs> we'll earn money once we have industry on and stuff. We just don't have any, we aren't unpaused yet, so we don't need to worry about that too much yet. Oh my God, you guys. I'm, I feel like I should have, um, I feel like I should have just done everything differently to be completely honest with you. Welcome to how I play City Skylines, where I um, will just, I'm all over the place. No one's here for quality gameplay, right? You're here because you wanna, you wanna uh, vibe, right? Good. Okay, that's how you can get to the industry area, I've decided. <laughs> I think this will be really lovely. And we'll have a nice little road and there'll be some nice little things. Should we do like a... Do you wanna have like a coal power plant? In this game also, um, we could get a trans... Where's the power? In this game, you can get like a transformer station and you can um, like borrow, buy power from other people as well, from like the city. So that's interesting. Maybe do an enter from the highway. So Bestie, we haven't unpaused yet. We don't have all those roads unlocked, okay? <laughs> I'm not gonna mess with that too much yet, okay? It costs money to buy the power, except um, City Planner Play says that it's not that bad. And I listened to him because he knows what he's talking about. It might be cheaper than buying a proper coal power plant for now. So maybe that's for the best. What do you think? I don't know. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put a little transformer over here and I'm gonna hook these up. And all that is connected through the roads. I don't know if we have, there's like not any good spots for wind turbines here. We're not like in a good area to use them. I don't know if you can see that, but electricity production 0 0.36 out of five. <laughs> this is not a good map to be trying to do wind power. It depends on where you are, what is best. Um, this particular map is not so good for wind power, it seems. Slope too steep, okay. I hate you for that, I mean it. Invalid shape? 
Is it because I'm trying to put it off of the like... Okay. Can I just have those roads be kind of bad for now? I don't know. I don't know. You just watched a let's play of this uh, and they put the sewage plant upstream and polluted the drinking water. Oh, good. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> that worked out really well then, I guess. Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. <laughs> okay. Okay. So we have water. We have power. Are we okay now? Oh, you guys aren't okay because I got rid of your road. Oh my god. Um, listen everyone. Just bear with me, okay? I'm- I'm still figuring out what I want. Okay? <laughs> I don't know what I'm going for yet. Um, you go this way. You go this way. These little squares are places that I can zone. So if I um, put zoning in there, that's how you have like, um, that's where it knows where to build houses and where to build shops and stuff. So the green is houses, the blue is shops, and the yellow is like industry stuff. What game is this? Sims 2? <laughs> I don't know if you're joking or not. It's not The Sims 2. Um, this is a, uh, it's a game called City Skylines. Um, that's what we're playing right now. It's, it's City Skylines 2. And it just came out today. <laughs> okay. Okay. I hate my city grid. <sighs> Things are not going that well, everyone. Things are not going that well at all. It's okay. It's okay. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Yeah, you can have like tall buildings and stuff. Yeah, we're just starting obviously. So um, our town currently has, as you can see, zero people in it. Um, but eventually we'll get people in it. And then, and then uh, we'll like level up and build up and all that sort of thing. Um, it's just at the moment, there's nobody. So. Soon we might have our first person, but it's not that time yet. <gasps> One person! Two people! Yes! <laughs> Three people! Yes! <laughs> Look, isn't it cute? Yeah, we need to like super zone up some more um, residential areas, I think. Um, I don't really like the idea of this being so close to the water. Maybe I should try and build... Um... Oh no, you guys, this is a disaster. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay. That's fine. Just put zone them. Usually mark the first house as historic for symbolism. Oh, that's cute. Where was it? Was it this one? Yeah, 25 Summit Street. That's so cute. We'll have to keep that in mind. All right. We're getting there. We have 68 people now. What do you do in gameplay? Well, you build and manage a city. Um, so uh, as we continue going here, um, it'll we'll like keep trying to manage traffic and manage the city's needs. And um, as we're we're just a level one or <laughs> we're level zero actually, <laughs> we are level zero right now. Um, but as you level up, then you unlock like schools and healthcare and all that sort of thing. Um, we just don't have. Uh, <laughs> we don't have any of that yet. <laughs> no, LV, you cannot get this game on mobile. Um, this game is a lot more intensive than that. Um, you will see as we get like further into it, um, but this is not the kind of game that you can play on mobile. So 
didn't know we had to unlock healthcare. <laughs> yeah, you do have to unlock it eventually. Um, we're almost about to level up. There we go. Tiny village. We got six hundred thousand small dollars. <laughs> six hundred thousand dollars. Okay. And a pop musician mansion. The terrace of this house is perfect for the parties the pop star living here loves to throw. Okay. Um, so now we have map tile, city budget, city statistics, EU medium density row housing. We can start building medium density. <laughs> That's so fun. Um, we have some more roads. We also got healthcare and death care and garbage management. So we have to start trying to add that stuff in now. Um, because we just unlocked the healthcare, so that's kind of important, I would I would say. Um, I think it's probably for the best if we put the healthcare, like, somewhere... Sorry. I'm thinking somewhere kind of central to the rest of the town. Yeah. And then... Look at how big this cemetery is. You forgot to add death care in yours and it was not good. Oh no. That is not good. Um, should we put... Maybe this cemetery could be good, like out here. Shh. I don't need info about it. Do you think it'd be weird to put it out by the, the water? Maybe. I want to kind of get it, like, in the middle of the forest. Oh, maybe. Oh, also, I should have had, um, sorry. I don't want to destroy your building, but I may have to. Where are you? Go away. Oh my god, I'm overwhelmed. Sorry. Um, water is not great for cemeteries generally. I mean, I, I suppose that's probably true. I, I guess that does check out. No, I don't like that there. I think I want to have this go like here. So I'll do that somewhere else. I need to hurry up with this. Sorry, hold on. Let me start thinking about the cemetery first and then. I was picturing us putting the cemetery like near the forest? Oh, it's in there. It's happening. Look at how big that is. Oh no. Oh no, no, no! I didn't level it! Can you even move it once you place the cemetery? <laughs> updates to our power grid the city will be oh no rolling blackouts we urge the public to remain okay I'm gonna just scoot this back a little bit to follow the guidelines on the city's website on how to okay for these temporary events level this out just this by the cemetery the and then I'll fix the road local authorities are urging the public to conserve water and reduce the burden on the city during this water okay. shortage. no 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 consider installing a low flush toilet cut back on watering the lawn and shower with a friend okay. whenever possible Thanks, lady. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. That's fine. She just suggested showering with a friend. Yeah, I don't know. Save some water, I guess. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, quite frankly, yes. Um, it is an additional expense, but the residents of okay. expect a certain level of services, and we simply do not have okay. the capacity to provide them within the city. Okay. Sounds like we're the ones who will end up paying for it. Should we be worried? I expect the residents would be more distressed if key services became unavailable. Their quality of life is very important to them. But so is their money. We'll be back after them. I'm nervous. <laughs> shortage is driving up prices in the area. <laughs> oh, okay, should I put like a big long road there? 
Welcome, Professor. So, uh, the radio is so interesting. I'm not used to listening to all of this. <laughs> I don't know. It's fascinating. You like the talking? Yeah, it's kind of curious. I feel like I shouldn't talk over them, though. But I don't know. You like the fake radio ads? Yeah, I think it's kind of fun. I don't know if it's the best for, for like, stream, but... Sorry, mister. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Well, what if we did this and then we'll put like, I guess I could probably get some trees. I don't know if trees are expensive, but I could probably put some trees here to like block the highway, you know? That might be good. Okay. Um, here's a fun idea. What if we had like, oh no, I almost want to start over. <laughs> you put trees one by one? Well, you can have, um, there's like a tree brush you can use too, but I was putting the one by one just then. Um, okay, so now we have the medium density row housing. What if we got some on like this? What do you think it'll look like? Try that, build me some housing. I'm really curious to see what it looks like. Is it weird to have it next to the cemetery though? I should have planned this more. I'm just an overthinker. It's really not that deep. It's like really, really not that deep. I don't think it's weird to have it next to the cemetery. A convenient location. Oh, I need trash. Oh, I knew I was forgetting something. Oh my God, get it together, Kayla. Okay, so here's something really cool about this game um, that I was very excited about and I think you will be too. Um, the trash in this game is like, I'm gonna put it by the highway. Um, but basically, you can build the landfill. Oh, no, wrong thing. Okay, add a node, add a node. Is that, did I do that in like a terrible spot? I don't know. But you can build like a custom sized landfill. Is that, oh, it falls off a cliff. Oh no. Don't look at that, okay? Shh. Ignore that. <laughs> anyway, I feel like some people are really good at planning out their cities and stuff in this game, and I am not. I am just not. I am not some people. It's too close to the houses, too. Oh, you think? I guess I don't really think about that. How do you see... Is there a pollution thing? We'll find out how it goes. No planning, all just vibes. Yeah, see, this is my first time playing City Skylines too. So we are allowed to make mistakes. You know? People are mad about our unreliable healthcare coverage. Oh my God, grow up. That's the only like, Minus one happiness that we have. No one's first city is perfect, no. Did you plan things out a lot in City Skylines 1? You know, most of the time when I play the, the previous City Skylines game, I like to play sort of sandboxy. Um, I don't usually play with the simulation aspect too much. I like to just build cities um, and like basically play with cheats. <laughs> like I, I like to um, play with like unlimited money and stuff. Um, I find it kind of fun to to do that. I'm gonna put some commercial down here by the city area. But yeah, I just, I, or by the river, I mean, I just, and the highway. Um, but yeah, I, I like to just uh, play with cheats a little. Okay, I need to build up my industrial area and I haven't really, we haven't really been planning for that too much, uh, everyone. 
No one is shocked by that. Um, this is horrible, actually. Look how much industrial need they have. Not good. Not good. You would live here, really? Oh, what's your problem? Never mind, you're fine. You play The Sims without money too, really? <laughs> is it gonna be on YouTube? Yeah, I post all my live streams on YouTube. Um, so I will, I will post this one as well on More Simsy. I'm not gonna do like um, a Let's Play on YouTube with this one. Um, I'm I'm just kind of playing it for fun here, but um, and on stream I mean, and not on YouTube. So maybe I'll get a couple little bits of shops down here so we can build some more houses by them. Because I think some houses down by the water would be really nice. Except those are on the other side of the highway. So that's probably not so nice. Oh well. I think they'll be fine. <laughs> Hi Tony! Did you get home okay and everything? Oh, that looks bad. Okay. We're about to upgrade again, that's good. Okay. Oh my god, they need so much commercial. <sighs> They're very dramatic. Anyway, how are you all doing? You always turn off the night cycle in this game? Yeah, I used to turn off the night cycle most of the time in, um, in the previous game. I didn't get a chance to look at these yet. Look at how cute that is. Oh, milestone two, small village. Okay, progression panel. What do you got for us? Um, oh, we have education and research now. Okay, we should probably start adding in the schools. Um, there's also this new development tree thing um, that I'm not like the smartest and most familiar with yet, obviously, given I have not played this game yet. But there, we get these like development points and um, City Planner Play says that I should try and unlock advanced road services first. So I listen to him, but other than that, I don't know what to do next. <laughs> other than that, I'm not sure what to upgrade first. Cause you can get like an emergency battery station, a gas power plant. We can get water treatment plants. We can get crematoriums and hospitals, um, other kinds of plants. We can get a college if we wanted to. He said like, oh, if you really want to have like trains, you could save your points to like upgrade for things like that. Um, but anyway, the main road is getting slightly crowded, you believe? Yeah, it probably is a little bit. Should I get roundabouts? And then we save a development point. They do have healthcare now, so they don't need a hospital yet, I don't think. I think we'll be okay without a hospital yet. You know what we could also do is um, purchase more map tiles. We definitely need to get probably some of these because we're trying to expand our industry out there. Um, maybe I'll get this one too. We have money so we can spend it on Upgrade permits. Oh my god, this is a disaster. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Um, should I turn off the day-night cycle? I think I want it to be daytime. Is it gonna be only night? Oh no, never mind. I think I want it to be daytime just because I have a hard time planning when I can't see it right now. Um. Okay, okay. So. I wanna build, are these all, look at all my houses. Oh my God, wait, look. Look at how cute they are. <laughs> I love them. That's so cute. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. Um, I'm gonna actually un unfortunately destroy your house, mister. But I think I wanted to destroy yours. It's just, just the one. Cause I need some more roads. Um. Yeah, this is, I didn't really think this through. I 
I feel like I needed, I should have planned this whole thing better and I regret everything I've done so far. <sighs> okay, no, it's fine. 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 This is the roundabout tool. We can, oh, I can make it bigger if I wanted. Oh, that's so fun. There's just one built in so nicely. I don't think I'll build you any right now. Okay, <laughs> Lisa and all of Beth, thank you for the subs. Um, um, I need to build space where we can have, I wish I had a more formal grid that I could use for the um, medium density housing more so. Oh, I did not mean to do that. <laughs> I thought I had a road. I put a roundabout there by accident. Uh oh. Oh no. Guys. Healthcare? We have healthcare. We're missing a school. I do have healthcare. It's right there. Um, what we don't have yet is the schools because we just built them. And I just destroyed someone's entire road. So that's um, actually, uh, unfortunately, a really, really bad situation that I'm in right now. Yeah. I'm gonna have to redo that. Okay. Can I just pause? Cause I messed that up. I'm so sorry to all of my friends. Um, that was not good. That was not good at all. Okay. Okay, someone take away her bulldozer. I know I'm destroying these people's homes. I think they'll get over it though, right? Sorry. My bad. Um, I'm gonna rebuild that road a little bit right there. And I'm gonna make this straight. Okay. Okay, we can get some medium density in there. Yeah, you can add parks. I haven't unlocked parks yet though. We're only just starting. You can destroy my house anyway, any day, because I know you'll build it back better. See, you get it, Bruin. You understand. You'd make the first roundabout bigger to let traffic flow better. Yeah, but the, I think that there's like some, oh, I just destroyed some of their houses. Bigger is better though, now that we have the roundabout tool. They'll, they'll do better with that. Sorry about what I did for your, house. Should I put a roundabout down there just for funsies? No, that looks terrible. Sorry. That was truly superb. Oh my god, go away. I just got the squat. I'm working on the squasher downer achievement. I think that's from me bulldozing people's houses. Look. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> that's really bad. <laughs> Sorry about that, everybody. Um, I will work on not squashing down your homes in the future. Um, you know what we could do is try and connect this up. I don't know if this is a bad idea or not. It might be, but... Oh, that's, I don't know. That's another highway that we're connected to. So that's good, I guess. And now I've got a cemetery in the middle of downtown. <laughs> I like it. Okay, um, let's build some more roads that I wanna put. Maybe I can put a road like along the whole cemetery. I could see that happening, right? It's kind of a weird grid shape, but that's good. You did think it was a park? Oh no, no, it's it's a cemetery. Yeah, all my dead people are in there, actually. Okay, this part is, we're getting a little bit, um, it's getting a little high up. So that part is not so good. Here. You can have some little shops. Uh, a lot of places in real life, I think, have, um, maybe some people live by the cemetery. A lot of places in real life have, like, 
cemeteries downtown because it's old. They were been they've been there. They were there first. So that's okay. I think that this cemetery also is are you okay? Condemned? Oh, really? Sorry. I think that this cemetery also counts as being like Yeah, it gives plus three recreation. So people can walk through it like a park for real. Yeah, Jackson, there will be so I think that like people kinda don't understand this part of the game yet, but you don't unlock the huge skyscrapers right away. Like right now, 591 people live in our town. So we don't have any skyscrapers because we're like early. <laughs> you like slowly, um, as you level up and as your city gets built, that's when you get skyscrapers. Um, we just don't have them yet. Um, budget, revenue, expenses, monthly balance. I haven't really looked at this yet. Our expenses are more money than we make. <laughs> I wonder, um, I wonder if it's acceptable for us to increase the tax rate at all, or if people would get mad at us. We are like, I think a little bit in the zone of them hating me, but. Oh well. Whatever. That's not my problem. I think up to 11 or 12. Is that true of City Skylines 2? Because I know that there's like a safe bet, like safe spot in City Skylines 1, but I'm not, I haven't played enough on this one. I don't know how much you can tax these people without them getting, without them getting too mad. Which honestly is quite rude of them because I, I personally believe that I know what's best for you and you don't. Little city people. So there. <laughs> I know what you want and you have no idea. It's under 12 as long as the zoning demand is balanced. Okay, that's good to know. Um. I'm not sure. There's a highway here. I don't think these people are gonna like it, but I'm gonna put some little houses and I'll put some shops for them too. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Why is that doing that all the way there? Is that gonna be like on the high, no it's not, okay. Oh, it's like a, it's a ramp, that's why it's under it. All right. Yeah, we need to start thinking about... You can also raise the taxes all the way and then lower them back down when they start complaining to get more money quickly. <laughs> I mean, that does sound like a good idea. Sure. <laughs> is this game on Game Pass? Oh, I don't know. Does anyone know if this game is on Game Pass? It did uh, just come out today, by the way, the new City Skylines game. I don't think I've done a very good job, to be completely honest with you. I'm not really obsessed with it. It's on PC Game Pass. There you go. We are happy to announce our new factory at 162 Oak Street. Oh, what are you mad about? Oh my God, you know what I still don't have is education. I knew I was forgetting something. Oh, get it together, Kayla, okay. We need to put an elementary school. Um. Can I put it over here? I'm sorry to just destroy your house. I know you just built that, but. Let's put like an elementary school, cause that's relatively, I don't know. Maybe they can have a shop in front of it or something. I 
Is it just me or is it seriously hashtag hot out there? Our hashtag education system is so amazing. I don't know about that. I am working on it. Okay. We need to get a high school too, but the high schools are absolutely enormous. And I didn't really prepare for this. You guys, I don't think I did a very good job. <laughs> oh no, because we're getting up into like the forest and I wanted to preserve some of the forest, but We may have to deforest a little so that we can add the school in. You know what I could maybe do is get, um, what if the high school goes? Okay, the high school can sort of back up into the forest a little. Oh no. Oh my God. <laughs> ah, <laughs> okay. Um, the terrain is actually not flat, everyone. No, that's no good. <laughs> okay. Um, you also, with the high school, I have learned the hard way. Um, is this expensive? Oh. Does it not cost me money to do it? To level the terrain? Can I just do whatever I want with terrain? When I unpause, it will cost me money. No, I am unpaused, okay. It's free. It's free to level terrain in this game. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's really good. I was, oh geez, okay. I was expecting to have to pay for that. So that is really good, actually. They removed the paying requirements in this game. Okay, I didn't know about that part yet. That's a surprise to me and I'm really pleased. Before in the old games, you had to pay to level the terrain. Um, okay, so here's something that is new. Look at this. There's building upgrades. So we can get like an extension wing to make room for more students. We don't need that yet. It's a 400 student capacity. We only have 900 people in the whole town, so that's fine. Um, school library gives us a better chance of graduating. There's also a sports field, which is like a massive outdoor recreation area. And I'm kind of intrigued by the thought of having an attached sports field to the school. And that can be like the last thing that we put in between the buffer of the industrial area. Okay. Maybe I will, oh, I've got pathways now too, good. Let's level this out a little bit. Okay. I can't believe how much easier it is to do the terrain now. I'm like actually so excited about that. I don't really want to do pathways though. Okay. I'm feeling a lot better now, everyone. Oh no, Honest, I'm really sorry about that. Yeah, the, um, my meet and greet uh, was like, the line was full. Um, so I was, it took me the full two hours, <laughs> which unfortunately means um, that it also, uh, made everyone wait the full two hours. <laughs> um, if you were, uh, if you were there, that meant that you also, um, had to be in the line for the full two hours, which I'm really, I'm sorry about. Um, there's really no better way to go about that. Um. That is so ugly. I don't really care. I want to have it connect up. Am I nervous talking to so many people at the meet and greets? I am, um, you know, it's sort of, I have sort of like complicated feelings about that because yes and no. Like um, I get really nervous leading up to those things. Um, it's really, really, uh, intimidating and kind of scary for me to do a meet and greet because I'm like nervous about people having a bad time and like what if I'm different than they expect and what if I'm not good at it and like what if I disappoint them or what you know all these things um, I get kind of nervous about it um, but uh, I I don't think that I'm bad at or that nervous about it just a little bit you know 
Meeting a lot of people at once is kind of intimidating though, obviously. <laughs> um, and it's kind of like a weird sort of interaction to have too, because like, uh, it's, it has to be cut short. Like the nature of the thing is like, I can talk to you for a little bit and then you have to leave <laughs> because I have to go to the next person. So it's, it's, uh, it's just sort of a weird, um, it's just kind of weird to do in general, but I think that makes sense. It's weird to go to, it's weird to, but that's just kind of how it works, you know? Um, you liked the panel we did? I'm so glad. I, uh, yeah, we did a panel about charity streaming, so that was pretty good also, I think. Um, I'm sorry to keep switching the radio station. How many minutes you get, do you get to speak to each person for? Ah, I don't, I don't know. Like one, <laughs> it depends. It really depends um, on, like at TwitchCon it was a little bit easier because they were not being pushy. Um, at VidCon, they were like, next, leave, pose with a photo and go away. Like the security at uh, VidCon was like telling people to leave. Um, oh, this being high density here looks kind of weird because they're like, I just haven't built them in there yet. Okay, anyway, at VidCon they were being like, get away. <laughs> Uh, which was kind of complicating things a little bit and um, making it kind of awkward. Um, but they had they gave people more time at TwitchCon, um, so that was nice of them, I guess. I really like how these medium density houses look. I think that's so cool. It's quite interesting. Although that on the hill, I don't know if that makes too much sense. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, the medium density is quite cool looking, isn't it? Like, look at how, look at that. Isn't that so fun? I love Sewer City, it's beautiful. Okay, let's try and get some more shops. Um, you know what we should do? Hold on. This high- okay, I have to pause the game for this. I'm gonna kill the highway a little bit. I'm gonna regret this so much, <laughs> but I'm gonna put a roundabout over here instead. I think- oh no. Oh, you guys, I think I ruined it. Do I even have- I don't have highways unlocked. I have- I do have one-way roads. Okay, we can make this work. It's gonna be fine. Um, it's gonna be totally fine. It's gonna be totally fine. It's gonna be so fine. Oh my god. I do have highways unlocked. No. I have medium roads. Highways are these. We don't have the highways yet. Um, unfortunately. That would be cool though, wouldn't it? Okay, um... Okay. Oops. Okay, 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 okay. 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 And then I get a roundabout on the end of this. Ooh, we are a large village. Okay. Now I have loan limit increase. We got service budgets, livestock farming, stone mining, fire and rescue. Guys, we can have firefighters now. <laughs> You know, that'll help. That'll help. <laughs> okay, this is good. We're getting there. We're getting there. The next one is big. It's the Grand Village. That's gonna really change everything. Okay. Um, I wanna put... Invalid Shape. Oh my god, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Oh no, I'm not good enough at this game to... Um... Okay, hold on. Hold on. Shh, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Shh, okay, okay. Overlapping items, okay. 
This is because I deleted something that I shouldn't have. Let's just be clear there, okay? This is Lil Simsy's own fault. Um, okay, let's see if I can get these to hook up again. If it isn't the consequences of my own actions. Okay, um. Shh, it's gonna be okay. Okay. You guys like that? gonna let it run. <laughs> Just gonna let it run. <laughs> you can't laugh, okay? Until you try, you can't laugh. What is- what am I doing? Those are one-way rows! Oh my god, Lil Simsy. Which of these fixes- which of these is a replacer? Replace. Did that make a bridge? Are you serious? Oh my god. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna mess with the- I'm not gonna mess with the terrain, I just won't. <laughs> oh, okay. I feel good now. It's nice, right? I have, um... Am I allowed to buy extra map tiles? I was gonna try to preserve some of the forest, but maybe I should, like, not. Maybe I'll buy some of this. Huh. What if I started buying out here so I could expand this way? Or we could just kill the forest. That would make things easier. <laughs> I don't know. We love deforestation. Yeah, me, me too. All right, they're gonna need some more medium density residential, but make some houses on the islands. Oh, you know what we got? Oh, also, hold on, before I do that, I need a fire station. <laughs> hold on, everybody, this is important. <laughs> Let me think about, um, maybe I can put it like, there's some space for you down here. I also need, well, that was the police, this is the fire department, okay. Um, we could use a fire department. That'll also help us. Anyway, um, we have, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, we have, there's like an unlock of, um, I don't know how you get to it. Signature buildings, yes. I got the pop musician mansion. So maybe I could build the pop musician their own like, private island mansion. <laughs> do you guys think we should do that? Wouldn't that be kind of cool? They have a private island. Um, I guess they need a road though, so that's kind of weird. Okay. 
slope too steep? Really? Okay. I guess we'll start the bridge. Well, that makes no sense. <laughs> no, the bridge should be like right here because it's small. Okay. 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 What do you think? There you go. Pop Musician Mansion! Hold on. Shh, fire safety, go away. How do I, let me, go away. I probably should have put the, um, the signature building closer to like, how do you, I want to change the name of this street. How do you do it? Help. Can I make it Cornelia Street? What else do we have? Theater actor mansion, sculptor mansion, that's so fun. Huh, it looks nice. It's kind of slopey, but... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay, oh. Population increased, it isn't happiness. Oh good, okay. Um, we need to start thinking about the smog is unbearable. Someone should deal with all this air pollution. Oh, <laughs> yikes. <laughs> yikes. Um, anyway, oh, I was just in the tutorial. Sorry, hold on. This is Taylor Swift Street, Corn Cornelia. No, she will never walk it again, hold on. Um, let's just call it Swift Street for now. Oh my god, you guys, our demand is extremely high. Okay, um... Overlapping items. Can I...? Let's just start a very ever so... Are you serious? Stop. Okay, that's going up the hill as well. Oh no. <laughs> What's the difference between City Skylines 1 and 2? Sweet, a lot of things. <laughs> like, like, so many things are different between this game and the previous. There's so many, um, massive, like, quality of life improvements as well. I mean, you think, you can compare, like, The Sims 3 and The Sims 4, right? What's different between them? I mean, at its core, it's a very similar game, but <laughs> like, so much has changed in like the abilities to, um, like the game running better, um, and and like uh, your controls are better, more you can do. Um, there's a lot of like specific things that you can control and adjust uh, more finely in City Skylines too than, than you could in the older ones. Um, it's pretty nice. The older one, singular, sorry. Um, a lot of stuff that like, for example, there used to be, people would use mods for, um, slope too steep. Am I like still on a bridge? I might still be on a bridge, that might be the problem. Um, or maybe the slope just is too steep, oh, okay. Um, yeah, a lot of the things that people used to have to use mods for in the previous City Skyline game, um, we don't need to have mods for anymore. Do I need to kill you? Hold on. Um, like some of the like road customization options. Overlapping items. What are you, what's your problem? Hi Kayla! Oh my God. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> it's good to see you friend. We're playing a little bit of City Skylines too. We are thriving. Um, I'm actually, I'm not cause I'm trying to figure out where to put out these roads and I don't know what I want to do yet. So never mind. I'm not thriving, but. What is wrong with me? Yeah, this changing stop signs in traffic, look at this. 
Um, we have some options. You can like add and remove crosswalks. If I wanted to, I could like uh, get rid of them and stuff. I didn't mean to do that. Um, I can also like put, I don't know if you can see this, but there's no traffic light here. I could put traffic lights there if I wanted to. Um, lots of stuff like that uh, that you didn't used to be able to do in the previous game. So you have some more like road controls um, that you can access at default in this game. Um, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> a good birthday with cities coming out, right? I know. Happy birthday, Kayla, by the way. It's good to see you. Your city was so bad. Oh, did you play too? Oh my goodness. I, I actually think I'm doing terribly right now, to be honest. I'm kind of wishing that um, I could restart. <laughs> I thought I clicked through all of this already. Let me out. I don't need a tutorial. I'll do what I want. You could. I'm not gonna restart. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. That's a terrible idea. Also, um, my friends in my stream, if you don't follow Kayla already on, on Twitch, um, you really should. I'm in the ground! That's why! Oh my god. Here I was trying to wonder why I was doing that. I was in the ground. You guys, that's actually, like, genuinely embarrassing. The one urban planning course I took in undergrad is making me feel like an expert, really. The uh, handful of City Skylines videos from my favorite YouTuber, City Planner Plays, is making me feel like an expert. <laughs> uh, shout out to City Planner Plays, who um, is a genius, basically. Now that looks horrible. You guys, I don't know where I want to build the, um, the new neighborhoods. Spruce Street, you're in the way. Uh-oh. I'm in underground mode, that's why. Oh my god, sorry guys. No one said that Lil Simsy was an expert at this game, okay? And if you thought that, well. <sighs> I'm sorry. Um, this might be good because we could get some more um, houses down here by the water. Oh, they're not going to like that. That's very close to the highway. Oh, well. Make a bridge through the river. Yeah, we could probably start working on that. What I need to do is come over to the other side of the... Do you guys think that it would be so ridiculous if I, like, leveled the terrain in this forest? It would be a little bit, right? If I went in and, like, really tried to flatten this out. But then I could try and use some of it, you know? And it doesn't cost me money to level terrain in this game, I've learned, so... I'll do what I want. Oh, that's no good. Hold on. Okay. I shouldn't be doing this. Big mistakes. Big mistakes. Well, listen, at least next time we play, we'll be better at it. You know? <laughs> Can we have more smog? Yeah, I've been thinking about trying to make the city feel more polluted, you know? Seems like a, a good way to, to go about improving the lives of my citizens. They're actually really happy. Like, look at that. They love it here. Okay. Um... I have to, I'm really sorry, but I have to break up your little neighborhood. So that stinks for you, sorry. Oh my God. Stop, it's not flat enough, don't do that. Oh my God. 
I don't know what I want to do. I don't know what I want to do. I don't know what I want to do. Um... Okay, let's build some more- let's flatten it more. Okay, sorry that you guys to watch me do this because I don't even know what I want. I'm gonna flatten it loads more. I have decided. That is the goal. Ooh. Don't flatten it too much though. Cause we don't want the river to flood. <laughs> that would be a problem. That would be a big, big, big problem actually. Yeah. So never mind there. We'll flatten some of it though. Um. I'm struggling with the spam of questions. I might rely on chat for this one a little bit. People asking what are the main differences between this game and the old one. And here's the thing, chat. The old one, correct me, came out in 2014. Is that correct? Um, it's old. <laughs> the old one is old. Um, so, so 2015, the old one came out. Um, so when we're talking about this new game, um, there's a, a ton of quality of life improvements for you, the player, because they have added in so many more features that make the city so much more customizable. Um, like, just to give you a couple small things, um, for example, like, the- stop with the radio. The, um, the pipes and stuff attached to the roads. You have the ability to add in, like, uh, like, stop signs and change the traffic signals. Like, a lot of stuff people used to have to use mods for in the old Sims game- or the old City Skylines game. Um, it's built straight into this game. So there's, a uh, a lot of massive improvements on how the game runs. My citizens are getting sick, are they? Oh my god, hold on. There's a lot of massive improvements that way. Um, you are upset because of a lack of labor. You are mad because you have high rent. You don't have enough labor either. Well, I can't, hold on, I'm talking too much. Um, there's a roundabout tool built into the game that used to be a mod. So a lot of things that used to be mod, um, they like built in as default features. Um, like things that people used to find the game unplayable without and then you had to get mods for are now built in features. Um, Graphics are better. Obviously, it was made in 2023, so it runs better. Um, she does have some kind of high spec requirements, um, but I haven't had any problems. So, um, anyway, lots of things like that uh, are are different. Um, certainly doesn't run better. Okay. <laughs> um, I don't know. I feel like it runs fine, but I know they've had some problems with it. Um, but um, anyway. I think, I don't know what I want to do. I'm really stressing myself out with like the layout of this. Do I think it'll run decent on your MacBook Air? <laughs> um, they do have, there's information, um, there's information out there uh, about like min spec requirements and stuff um, that, will, that will give you some help, but she definitely, uh, no. <laughs> and it, it's not on Mac anyway, isn't it? Um, but uh, yeah, I think it would probably struggle to run on a laptop. Um, these are the kind of things that you can like find online though. If you're thinking like, is it gonna run on my computer? Um, you can look up some like min spec requirements and stuff like that to see if it would uh, work for you. Um, Cause I don't know like what your computer is like and, and what your situation is like with your setup. So, um, okay. Um, I think I'm gonna have a road go follow behind the school. Okay, no, I need to delete that road again because I need to flatten it still. Um, that's true, Christine. Yeah, if you buy it on Steam and, and um, realize it doesn't work, you can request refunds on Steam if you have less than two hours of playtime. So um, anyway, you, you would know if this is the kind of game that you're interested in playing though, obviously. Um, but anyway. I've really been enjoying playing this this game as a person who's been a massive fan of City Skylines for many years. There's a lot of really cool features in it, um, and I've been having a lot of fun, so. Um, okay, I wanna get another road built right here, like I said before. Oh my God, you are really complicating things. Me having the elementary school here was a mistake. Okay, um, 
<laughs> Look, at, I have to like just angle it ever so slightly. That's okay. That is okay. Um, let's get some low density housing up here. I am probably going to end up um, having to build walls through some other houses or roads, I mean. Um, yeah, it's on the PC Game Pass too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, anyway. I think our electricity department production is not meeting demands. We're forced to import some from our neighbors. Yeah, but aren't I doing that on purpose? Hold on. I was just buying some this whole time. That's what city planners play said to do. <laughs> okay. Um, I think I'm not meeting any of the demand. I'm starting to stress myself out. Okay. The wall, Sims is on Sims mode. Yeah, I meant to say the roads, not the walls, didn't I? I'm a Simmer though. What can I say? Maybe I'll build a road there so I can get these started. Okay, maybe we can have the grids get a little bit wider this way. Um, all right, no, Ziggy, I don't think it'll run that well on a laptop. The minimum spec requirements are pretty high on this game. Um, this is the kind of stuff that might be better suited for like you to research and stuff. There's a website called, is it called Can I Run It? Um, that sort of thing might be better suited for you to, to like research and figure out yourself. Not to like ignore your question, but I don't know what your computer is like, you know? Um, I don't know what your computer is like, so I don't know how to answer like, oh yeah, it'll definitely run. Cause I don't know what you have. <laughs> so, um, I am not sure the answer to that question for you specifically. Um, okay. Um, I think build this out a little bit more. Thank you. Good. Cool. Um, yeah, there's a video from City Planner Plays where he tested the game. Um, can one of the mod, Christine, can you link it maybe if you're still here? The video that he posted yesterday or whenever, I don't, I watched it yesterday. I don't know if it came out yesterday. I don't know why I said that. Um, but he, he posted a video where he was running on different computers. Might help, your, might help answer your question better. Um, okay. I also wanna get some more of the medium density housing. I think I may, uh, to be honest, I think I may kill some of my neighbor's houses. Oh no, I meant to rezone this. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry, I was gonna. Um, what have I done to you? Go away. Medium density everywhere. Oh my god, that was a complete disaster. Go away. Hold on. Go away. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, 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 sorry. I need to dezone and rezone it. Oh, I didn't want to get rid of this section. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was my bad. I was actually gonna just rezone these ones in the middle. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. <laughs> um, anyway, I do have some desire to uh, swap these out for medium density. So there, there. Did she delete her first house? No, I think the first house was somewhere like further over. I don't really remember or care though. Yeah, you can just place new zoning on top of the old zoning, which I guess makes things a little bit easier, but. Okay. Um, see, they're gonna need more low density residential too. Put some of that up here for you guys. And you also need more industrial, but I hate having to have industrial stuff. I don't like it. 
Um. Okay. Here you go, guys. Make some stuff. Yeah, I kicked hundreds of people out of their homes. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I'm really, really, really sorry. <laughs> Try building farms for industry. Yeah, there's so much stuff that we can do. I'm a little bit overwhelmed, uh, to be completely honest with you. As a person who's not, like, um, the most familiar with this game yet, I'm a little bit overwhelmed by the amount of, like, new stuff we can add in. Oh no. A building is on fire. Fires in buildings are a danger to both the buildings themselves and the residents inside. Fire engines have been dispatched to put it out. Oh no, but if the response time is too long, the fire can spread to nearby buildings. <laughs> Our fire station is pretty close by. It seems like we're all mostly fine. Yeah, that's no good. That is no good. We'll see how long it takes them to get here. You think if a person went into this game without playing the first one, they'd be so lost and overwhelmed? I- I think that in general, um... It- I don't know if it's necessarily to do with, like, the first one. I think that in general, just because it's like a- like a sort of intense management game, um, there's a lot that you can do. I think any sort of sandboxy, uh, building game is kind of like, oh my god, where do I begin? <laughs> like, I think even The Sims is like that when you're, like, first starting to build, because if you've never played it before, you're like, where do I even start with this, you know? Um, they did well. They put it out. Um, oh, new signature building lift available. Um, oh, that's too tall. I don't really know if I want that yet. Anyway, um, I think that, uh, that kind of goes for any sort of game like this, where it can be a little bit overwhelming at first, because you're just trying to figure out, like, what to do, and where to put everything, and what you want, and, like, all this stuff. Um, lots going on. You like how SimCity had tornadoes and stuff? Well, this game has natural disasters. I turned them off. I actually don't know, um... I don't know what the disaster situation is looking like in this game because I don't want them. <laughs> I don't want anything bad to happen. I don't like it when bad things happen in my game. I just want to play my little game. Nothing bad, nothing bad. Um, but yeah, I, I did in fact turn off the natural disasters. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, there's a whole lot of early access content out there. People had early access content for like a month going up. Um, which is pretty cool. Yeah, the last time I streamed City Skylines on this channel, we had a, um, a rather nightmarish forest fire. <laughs> so that was pretty bad. Um, yeah. Okay, let me look at... How's the pollution situation looking? That's not too bad, only some of their houses are affected. That's fine. I think we're okay. Um, I wanted to look at, oh. Oh, should we build like a, a little farm? Should I put like a little gravel road that goes out to the farmland? And we could put a little farm area. I don't know. That might be kind of fun. What kind of future does music have if it doesn't look to its past? Well, I say the question speaks for itself. Here on Second Moon, we know you sure. can't move forward unless you keep both eyes um, steadily trained on what's behind you. Okay. We've recently been having what's Interesting. The worst kind of luck there. Who is that man? Oh, it's the radio. And, uh, they speak to me sometimes. They're my friends. Okay, um, how, like, extra super bad would it be if I had, like, livestock farming? Oh, wow! Wait, that's so cool! 
<laughs> Hold on, this is so cool to me. Huh. How many? Hold on, I wanna make them big. I don't know how big they should be, but I'm really amazed by that. I've not, this is my first time doing this. Okay. Is that like, is that big enough? I don't even know. Overlapping items, liar. That is so cool. You can make that so beautiful. I'm making, um, that's, I'm like making some specialized livestock farming. You can make them as big as the circle. Oh, really? Should I get some more then? I don't know. I don't really know how many I should have. Maybe this guy can have like a really big farm. Oops. You don't like that it's overlapping. Okay, sorry. That looks horrible. <laughs> they need to be really big to be profitable. Oh, really? So should I delete them and just make one big one? Sorry, guys. I know that's your like business. Okay. Um, come back. Okay. Like that. Is that what you want? Okay. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm learning too. I don't know. Um. Oh. How about that for you? Can make you go up to the road? I guess I could have made it go up to the road, huh? Well, maybe I'll just let them be there for now. Should I put some little uh, houses out here too? What if I just built like a couple houses? I don't know. Out in the rural area? <laughs> I don't know. I can add and edit the points for the outline with the zoning tool. Oh, really? Oh. 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 I see. Sorry everyone for my lack of knowledge on this topic. I'm this I'm new. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's farmland. Isn't that cool? Hmm. So many hashtag open hashtag jobs. Okay, shut up. I need to hold on. I have to come back to this. They're complaining because I don't have enough people living in my stupid town. But I don't know where to put them all. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I didn't lay this out very well. <laughs> Should I make, what if I made this road? Hold on. Let's, okay, we'll pretend for a second that this road is like more of a main road, okay? Maybe I will. How do you replace a road again? 
No, replace, sorry. Um, whoa. Sure. Oh no. Oh no, you guys, this is a big problem. Sorry to all of you. Um, okay. My bad, I'm making a new main road. I'm extending it. So we can get some more like good high density, or sorry, some good, oh, they don't want any medium density anything. Okay, they do want some more shops though. So here. And my industrial situation is growing rather dire. So I guess I'll try and get some of those too. Um, sorry about your buildings, sorry. Sorry, so sorry about your buildings. Oh, I'm terrible. That's not even a grid, oh my god. <laughs> It looks so bad. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I'll make that straight now. Okay, that's better. Sorry, everyone. Hold on. Here's some more industry for you, grumpies. All right. Um, what happened to you? You seem fine. Okay, sorry. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. There is a grid tool. Yeah, there is a grid tool, but I don't really uh, want to use the grid tool because I'd rather do it custom, I think. I know I just got done saying that my grid looks bad and I'm bad at it, but I'd, I would uh, rather customize the grid than use a grid tool. Oh my god, look at that. Oh, besties, this situation is very dire. Okay, we have to do it again with the terrain. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try and bridge over this from here. I guess I'm too scared to do the slope tool. I think I'm gonna mess it up if I try and slope things. So I'm just instead like, Trying to level the terrain a little. But that's a mistake, probably. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ah! Oh my god, you can't undo. Oh no, you guys. I'm terrible and useless. Terrible and useless. Okay, I got it. Now we're going up. And then from here, we shall start bridging. That is a large bridge. Okay. That's fine by me. Ooh. We got a railroad. Okay. There's been a traffic accident. Oh. Help is on the way. Oh, we haven't had one of those yet. Where is it? Not you, surely. Oh, you're just mad because the rent is high. Okay, grow up. Do you see them? Well, what are you doing getting in an accident? Get it together. <laughs> Bridge looks boring? Okay! I know! I'm not good at this yet! <laughs> I know! <laughs> Please be nice, because I know I'm not very good yet. I'm working on it. Okay, sorry about all of your homes, everybody. That was rough. Um, yeah, I don't know about that. We'll see. 
Sure. Oh. Oh dear. The sloping situation? Not good. Don't look at it too closely, okay? <laughs> Don't look at that, all right? You guys got it? <laughs> We're not looking at that. Oops. Okay. This is terrible. This whole industrial area is not laid out well at all. I was just kind of expanding and expanding and expanding and expanding. <laughs> Mary, you know what? I, here's the thing, right? I am a person who is a massive fan of city skylines. Like I have been a massive fan of city skylines for a long time. So I knew that I was going to like this game and I'm not surprised in the slightest that I do like this game, you know, because um, I knew I was going to, because I'm such a massive fan of the original City Skylines. The slope is too steep. Surely not. Don't be silly. Okay, thank you. Anyway, I'm I'm having a great time today. We are thriving. Okay, I have to. I think I'm gonna rezone some of you guys. Sorry. I'm gonna rezone some of you as some high density, or medium density, sorry. I don't know. We'll see how that goes. Oh, make that more shops. They don't want any more shops. Okay. You can never so cool to watch. Yeah, the, I, this is sort of how I feel about this game too. I feel like I'm not, I'm not that good at playing it, but I really like to watch other people play it. <laughs> I just think City Skylines is so interesting. Difference between the blue grid and the green grid? Oh, the, um, Condemned, yikes. The blue is, um, the blue means it's, uh, shops, and the green is houses. What are you doing? Okay. Anyway, the, the blue is shops, the green is houses, and the yellow is industrial. We do have some points to unlock some things, don't we? Oh, I could unlock highways. I don't want highways right now. Can you stop talking? Thank you. Emergency shelter, fire watch tower, mm, bigger fire station, welfare office. I want to save, because at the Grand Village, I can unlock transportation and I'm going to want trains. But I guess I have four development points. Should we buy a college? Maybe. I should probably get like a hospital as well, right? Yeah. Yeah, I should. Okay. We should not buy that college right now. <laughs> Yikes. Um, we can't afford a hospital either. Oh, Grand Village. Well, there. <laughs> Speaking of which, we got it. Okay. Okay. So we got a million more dollars from that too. And now I can start getting the transportation that I want. I want trains. I really, really, really want trains. That excites me so much. Cause we can start like expanding out. We can get like this town can have like a train connecting it to this area and stuff. What's that? Oh, there's like a little windy old country road. But wouldn't that be cool if we like started building out here and we connected it all up with some trains? No buses or metros, OMG. No, we're gonna put buses. Oh my God, chill. <laughs> we just haven't gotten there yet. We only just unlocked it. We have, they have buses. Oh, you didn't see the option, I see. What the heck is purple? Oh, offices. Ugh. Okay. Um, yeah, well, buses are like the initial. So we can get a bus depot and then we also have trains now. Yeah, but buses are like the first thing you unlock. Where should I put the bus depot? I 
don't know. Maybe a hospital first? What, instead of a bus? You think? Build a bus depot. Bus stations or large bus stops? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, maybe I'll just put the big bus depot out here in the industrial area. Um, Cause that's where the buses come from. Um, oh, EU bus stop sign, EU bus stop shelter. Oh my God, wait. <gasps> you guys look. <laughs> I put in a bus stop right there by the school. Okay. Um, I'll put a bus stop by the other, the kids school too. And then maybe we can put a bus stop in there. Where was the... Hmm. I don't know where the best place to have the bus stops is. Probably on the main road. They have taxis too. That's so interesting. Okay. So we now have to try and make the bus line, which I figured would start down here, come up here, go to the schools, and then, oh, maybe I'll put like a, come here. Oh, did I mess up? Do I have to start over again? Oh no. Oh no. Guys, I don't know how to make a bus line that makes sense. <laughs> I don't know what the smartest thing to do is. I put those two close together, probably. There should be one, like, down here. Yeah, we can do multiple bus routes. We don't have to have just one. Um... Stop there. It'll stop there. You'll stop there. You'll stop there. There. Oh, that's terrible. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Doing this kind of thing in front of people makes me feel embarrassed. <laughs> Where's the station? No, the buses don't have to come from, okay, so basically there's a bus depot. This is where the buses will, will come out from and get repaired at, doesn't matter. The buses will go on this loop though. Does that make sense? Um, let's get a bus line that comes like up the main road. And then maybe it could come like, nothing connects up very nicely, does it? Oh, this is a terrible city. Listen, I, I, I'm, I'm learning again, okay? I'm not that good at this yet. It takes practice, okay? Oh, that was wrong. Okay, start down here. You're way too uneducated to make your own bus system. That's kind of how I'm feeling right now too. Is like I don't know how to, <laughs> I don't know how to best plan a bus loop. Wait, no, don't start there. Oh, I need to get them access to the city. Um, come here. We'll come. 
here. We'll stop over here and over here and then here and then here and then here and then here. Oh no. I'm gonna, when I get off stream, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna watch someone else make transportation lines, and then I'm gonna learn what they do, and then I'm gonna do it again later. That's what they have now, is they have buses, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna watch a little tutorial later, and then I'm gonna learn how to do it better, and then I'm gonna come back. <laughs> I'm gonna play it again, and then we're, we're, we're gonna figure it out, and it's gonna be better next time, okay? <laughs> Did you buy buses? Do I have to buy buses? It looks like there's... Oh... Huh. Oh, well, I'm gonna change the line color too. There. Okay. So, here's the thing, everybody. I need to buy buses. It seems like. Electric buses to upgrade my thingy. Oh, that's cool. Guys. How do I, maybe it's just my game's pause. How do I get vehicles? Should I upgrade my buses to be electric? I did. Oh, I have two vehicles in use. Oh, good. See, it's fine. Here they come, here they come, here they come. Four vehicles in use. Here they come, here they come, here they come. Good luck, everybody. Okay, I need to build some office buildings. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys, I have not planned this well at all. It's so, so, so not planned well at all. Um, I also need high density housing, but I don't like... <sighs> okay. What if we start... Oh, oops. What if we start trying to purchase some more of these tiles? Okay. And we start trying to get over here, like some higher density housing happening. Thoughts? I don't know. Problem is, maybe, oh, I should have bought over here. Cause there's a highway over here. Oh, wait a minute. How cool would it be if there was like high density downtown on this island. You know what else we could do is kill some people's houses to build some office buildings. Maybe just like a few, you know? Sorry. That was actually a lot of people's houses. It was not just a few. That was a- oh, I didn't mean to get rid of your building either. Sorry. Okay. Yikes. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, let's figure out where the high density is gonna go. Um... I guess over here, huh? I guess I want a bridge over that, huh? I don't know. Yeah, a university by the water would be kind of cute. <sighs> okay. 
Um, I want this grid to be like, yeah, I want to have a train station here. That's like my dream is to have a train station set up. I guess I bought, I did buy trains, didn't I? Well, this is going to be, oh my God. I don't really know if I'm cut out for this yet. A large complex used for the storing, sorting, and maintenance of trains. Oh my god. I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> We're gonna need to like... Okay, I don't know about public transportation yet. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready. Do train tracks annoy you in real life so you don't want to put them in your game? Really, I'm... I'm like the opposite, where I am so fascinated by trains in real life, and I wish, I wish that we had more trains where I live. Um, so I like really love the idea of putting trains in my game. <laughs> it's funny how um, how different it can be depending on like where you're from, huh? What are you doing? Okay. Well, that's a better looking bridge. I will say that. Someone earlier said my bridge was ugly, so I improved it. I guess we could. Oh, I probably shouldn't cross the train tracks yet, huh? But I guess also we could like... We could bridge the train tracks instead. Every bridge is beautiful. Th see, thank you. That's, you get it. Finally, someone who understands. Um, that's too steep. Okay. Are there bridge options? Like, to make it better looking? We don't have, um... So, so to answer your question... Yeah, there's better looking bridges. We just haven't really unlocked anything like that yet. Um... Oh, low rent housing. Large apartment buildings with small affordable apartments. The lower rents provide lower tax income as a result. Oh, that's so cool that they have that. I'm excited about that concept. Um, I didn't even know that was in here. Okay. Um, let's build... Okay. Okay, sure. I don't know. I don't know how big I want the grid to be. <laughs> Just build before the train tracks for now and do a waterfront area. That's kind of what I'm that's kind of what I'm leaning towards as well, I think, is to just like build something kind of along the water for now. It can be kind of curvy. I don't know. I think it being kind of curvy is fun. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Um. Okay. Curvy waterfront street. It's a snake! <laughs> I don't know. I'm appalled at how healthcare is run in this city. Oh my god, calm down! What are all your problems? Waiting for a hearse. Not enough customers. High rent. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, whatever. Grow up. Um, anyway. <laughs> 
Where was I building? Over here. Okay. Um, well, maybe I could build, like... Um... Okay. Um... Maybe... Over here... Oh, I have parks now, too. Oh, these are so cute. Oh, besties, we need to go and add this sort of thing in. What is that? Campfire site, dog park, small playground, small plaza. I like the idea of a small plaza. Let's add one of those. Okay. I'm playing on PC, Astro. It's, oh, this is on fire. There's, uh, this game is, is only on PC at the moment. Oh yeah, these people could really use some parks. So sorry about um, your lack of parks. But there, that's nice, see? I don't know. I don't know. Bro, now I'm scared. <laughs> now I'm scared. Um, is that for this? Oh, that's really nice. Someone bought a giveaway code for the game. Who? Let me scroll back. That's Fetch. Oh, that's Fetch. That was really nice of you. <laughs> Wait, should we do it right now? That's Fetch just bought a giveaway code for this game for us. You totally didn't have to do that, but you bought a giveaway code. We can do it. I'll do the giveaway right now. Why not? Okay. If you would like to enter for a chance to win a copy of City Skylines, thanks to that's Fetch in chat. Um, Amy in chat, sorry, I have their Discord name. They're Amy09X in chat. Um, if you would like to enter for a chance to win, you can type, uh, I haven't decided yet. Type the word cow plant in the chat for a chance to win. Um, that's very kind of you, Amy. <laughs> Thank you so much, I really appreciate that. Um, you can type the word cow plant um, in chat for a chance to win. What just happened? I, my stream manager just refreshed itself. I think I just got a Twitch update in the middle of my stream. My like whole dashboard just changed how it looks. What the heck? Okay, anyway, type, um, type cow plant in the chat for a chance to win uh, this game. Thanks to Amy in chat. Um, and also thanks again to, to City Skylines for sponsoring today's stream. Um, they, they were so kind to, uh, to do that, and I've been so excited about this, so, <laughs> um, I really appreciate it, because I have been looking forward to this game for so long. City Skylines is, like, one of my all-time favorite games literally ever. I am so fascinated by, I, I think this kind of checks out with my, like, obsession with The Sims. What I, what I always liked the most about The Sims was, like, the, the world building, and, like, the, um, you know, figuring out like, oh, my, my neighbors live here and my grandparents live down the road and I just built this bar for it. And I'm like sort of inventing like a world in The Sims for my Sims to live in and play in. And what I like about City Skylines is that you can sort of envision a city <laughs> and like, like build this cool customizable thing. It's very creative, but it's also a management game. So uh, you kind of have a little bit of both. I really don't think that I'm that good at it, if I'm being completely honest. I just think that it's really fun. Um, I Most of the time when I play this game, and I haven't played City Skylines 2 this way yet, but most of the time when I would play the old City Skylines game, I would play like with cheats and, and like in a sandbox mode. Because um, I just think it's kind of fun to, to build. <laughs> um, and thanks to Amy for buying a giveaway code for us. Um, that was so generous of you. There's like 600 entries. If you, were, if you missed it, we're doing a giveaway of City Skylines right now because someone in chat bought us a code to give away. Um, all you gotta do is type the word cow plant in the chat. That's a Sims thing. Um, <laughs> but, you know. <laughs> no, you don't need to be good to have fun. I agree. It's, as long as you, like, are having fun, it's okay. Um, the fun of, is, fun of it is just playing. But there's, I always feel a little bit inferior to, like, the other creators that I see playing City Skylines. Because I'm like, oh, I'm not smart or as as smart or as creative as, as you are when you do these sorts of things. I know I keep talking, I'm like embarrassed, but my favorite YouTuber is City Planner Plays. <laughs> he, um, he's like, he is a real life city planner. So he like really knows his stuff. Um, and it's just fascinating to watch a person who like, 
uh, thinks about things more logically play a game like this versus me who's like, I don't know, I'm going to put the office here, <laughs> you know, like, um, I'm, I'm not as uh, high level thinking <laughs> as that, you know. Okay, I'm going to the winner now. We have a giveaway going for it for this game. You can type the word cow plant in the chat for a chance to win. And the winner in like 10 seconds is 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Draw entrant. Star Daisy 2005, whose profile picture is a cat. Nice. <laughs> Congratulations, Star Daisy. I'm going to whisper you the copy of your code. Bro, did you type the thing that I can copy and paste? Um, okay. Okay. Oh, good. Thanks, Bro. That was easy. I'll just copy and paste that. Let me know, Star Daisy, when you see my DM. Let me know so that I know you've gotten it. Um, and thanks, Amy, for buying that. That was so generous of you. Oh, and we're back. Okay. <laughs> Focus. Focus, everybody, focus. Look, it's our first high density buildings. I still don't have um, business high density yet, but that's okay. Um, I'll put some high density housing all around in these areas. Um, okay. Yeah, this is a pretty cool community, isn't it? I, I like these these people. Um, okay, um, were we gonna put the college? I don't, I think that I might, like, totally ruin my own life by, by building this. Oh, I bought it. Okay. Yeah, we definitely can't afford that. <laughs> oh well. Let's get a little fire station in here too. Um, we could probably, maybe another elementary school would be good as well. Um, in this area, because there's more people living down here. And then we can get some more shops. I guess I can replace some of these shops eventually with like some bigger ones once we have the high density. That might be good. Hospital? Oh, I should get us. Oh my god, you guys. That's the first time I saved. <laughs> oh my god. We've been playing for like two hours. Oh no. Thank you for pointing that out, Christine. Oh my god. <laughs> that could have been really bad. It nothing happened. It's fine. <laughs> Well, the game, I mean, it's been running very stably, at least for me. We haven't had any problems, so. Anyway. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> that would have been really bad. I was talking about wanting to restart, wasn't I? So there's that, I guess. Um, I, did, I did say that I wanted to restart, but I don't think I meant it. Ooh. Well, that's kind of cool. Poor road conditions. Poor road conditions. Calm down. Okay, we should build a hospital too. This is a police station, not a hospital, but. Um. I guess, in hindsight, I really should have um. I really should have done this differently. Sorry, I'm not the best. How do you manage power grids here? Um, so the roads connect everything up. The roads have like power lines and sewers um, and water lines and stuff attached to them. Oh God. So the, the roads um, make things very easy in that way because you don't need to build separate ones or anything. It's pretty cool. I don't know if you can see this. When I build the road, do you see how there's like the three little dots under it kind of right there? Um, that's because it has the, the water, the power, and the sewer. 
Um, infrastructure is all built in there. Okay, I'll let it triple speed, I guess, for now. Yeah, the roads do that by default in this version of the game. Yeah, the new the new City Skylines 2 has that by default. There's so many things, like, um, we were talking about this earlier, but one of the other things that, like, really excites me is that we have, like, you can change some, some road rules. Like, you can add in traffic lights and stop signs and stuff like that. Um, you can also plant, look at this. This is how you can upgrade the road to have, like, trees on it. Um, which is kind of cool. We can put, like, trees on the side of the road this way. Um, I don't know if you can see them there, but... Um, there's lots of like little things that they have improved, like quality of life wise. There's like roundabout builders. A lot of stuff that the old city skylines used to have mods for um, is a lot of the stuff that they've built in by default. So, thanks, Kyle. Yeah, I had a really good time at TwitchCon. Um, I thought it was really fun. So, yeah, the way that we all used to build, like back in the day, we used to all do the pipes underneath every single road <laughs> individually. And now there's pipes like by default there, which make things, makes things a lot easier. Um, so that's pretty good. Look at these apartments, that's so nice. I'm pretty excited about that. Um, okay. Should I start trying to think about trains then? Probably. Probably. Okay. So we need to have the rail yard and then we have to get train stations. So how much is the rail yard? 150,000. Okay. Maybe I'll start thinking about the road networks more and then I can build it in. Um, go away. If I have to redo this train line, that's okay. I might need to like, to be honest, realistically, I could just break it and then build it again myself in a more useful area for me personally. <laughs> you know, like we can just get rid of it for a second and then do it again. Um, okay. And then we can try and put a hospital too. We'll build like a better hospital complex, yeah? Because I haven't done that yet. Okay. Um. The hospital can go over here. Oh no, we can't afford a hospital. Never mind. You have to have a medical clinic. Sorry, everyone. Um, go there. Cool. The hospital is so far away. Yeah, but we're gonna start building like so much out this way. So it's not gonna be far away by then. You know, we have to like think ahead. We're trying to plan all this for the future, right? Oh, that grid is kind of messed up. Oops. Okay. Um. <sighs> power plant? I still don't have a power plant, yeah. I've been using, I've been buying power so far. Um, but it might be time for us to begin to think about getting our own power plant as well. That's so, the grid is so messed up. Ew. Get it together. 90 degrees, 90 degrees, 90 degrees. Okay, I don't know. Could do a challenge, like reach 100K population on streams. Well, I mean, it'd be fun to expand the city that big. Uh, we currently have 3,000, so <laughs> we're not quite there yet. We're not quite there yet. Um, okay. Um, that is a lot of noise pollution. I wanna build this out with some more high density stuff downtown. But I guess we also need to have some more like lower density, small houses. Um, 
maybe we should like, what if we build a road that follows the, um, the river a little bit more? And we put on like this half of downtown some lower density stuff. Perhaps? Okay. That seems like it makes sense to me. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. What is lower and higher density? Okay, so high density is like this, like an apartment building, right? Um, we also have medium density, which is like this, like a like an attached house, like a townhouse sort of situation. Um, and then low density would be um, like out here. These are like individual houses, like a single family home that belongs to just one family versus like, you know, 10 families living in an apartment building or something. Um, so high density of people versus low density of people. Like there's a lot of people, high density living in a small space. Um, anyway, so houses are, that's the difference. Houses up to apartment buildings. Um, okay. I hate this part. <laughs> I hate that part. I think it's icky. Well, you know what'll be kind of cool is we can try to like, I think I'll try and put some more high density there. And then I feel like it would be kind of fun if we could get, um, well, eventually I want all of this to become like big, tall buildings too. But then what if there was like some medium density here and then it goes out into lower density behind that. See? That's kind of what I'm thinking at least. I'll let it run. But we can try and like... Um... Okay. Well, that's curved. I didn't mean for it to be... Um, kind of curvy. It's kind of cool. There's an entire county in your state that has no stoplights at all. Oh my gosh, really? That's quite interesting. Um, okay. I think it would probably be good if we had some straight roads like through here. Oh, no, stop. Some straight roads through here a little bit. All right. And then we can start zoning some regular houses in here too. Okay. There you go, everyone. I hope you like it. On the water. Yeah, no, it's not that unrealistic unreal to have no stoplights in a smaller space. It's just different from like where I'm from, you know? Um, it's interesting. Okay. Probably gonna need to get some more industry lined up too. <laughs> Yikes. Um, okay. So. I'm thinking. Oh, maybe it would be nice. Hold on. I hadn't really considered this. Is that straight? Okay. Maybe. We'll try and put like some trees in there so it helps to level that out a little bit more. Um, and we'll put nothing up against it. And I'll just get a road. Okay. And once there's trees, it'll help to hide it. Right? This big building is a university that I just built.
cool. Yeah, I mean, I can just try and stack some more industry over here. I don't think we're having too much trouble traffic wise. I want to get, I'm going to need to rehook up the highway situation, but I'm not really interested in trying to build a highway right now. They don't even have enough workers down here is the problem. Ugh. That's so rude of you guys. Get it together. Why is no one working down here? Oh, an exact tie between medium density and low density housing. That's so interesting. Um, I'm, I'm really curious about the, the exact tie. I wasn't expecting that, I don't think. Um, it's kind of fun. <laughs> Did I just hear a cat? No, I think I imagined it. Oh my God. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll need to build a bus line across the bridge too. Are you looking for a police car? Oh, you're waiting for a hearse. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you're gonna wait a while. Good luck. Good luck. We'll also probably need to get another bridge across the river over here too. Oh. Here, this is a this is an idea. Oh. Another connection that connects it back up to the industry area too. So that's good. I don't really want to listen to you. Oh my god, there's so many radio stations. It's kind of fun. Okay. Now what? They need more low density housing, I guess. Should I just let it run faster? Sure. <laughs> sure, I don't know. Yeah, that's true, Rin. Yeah. I think I'm too much of a planner and a perfectionist. Like, that's why I I sit here being like, oh my god, I need to restart. <laughs> I ruined it. When in reality, it's like so not a problem, you know? But I, I am a serious planner in this game, so I get myself kind of nervous there. Sorry about all of your houses, everyone. I did just... I let you just finish building them and then I went and bulldozed them. So that was my bad, but... Oh, Jess, I'm so glad. I, I'm really honestly so glad to hear that about your cat. You know who does have kidney disease? My cat. So. <sighs> okay, um, maybe, fi maybe finally have your own electric. Yeah, I was thinking about that. It was probably in our best interest to build like, maybe I should build like a power plant or something. Oh, tiny town. What did we get? Vegetable farming, coal mining, communications, post office. Ah, I see. Do I need a post office? Oh God. Okay. Um, um. Uh, let's start thinking about other services then. Police and administration, no. Landfill lot tool. It's so there's so many cool things here. Where do I get oh here we go. Post office. Um, I guess I'll put the post office like more 
downtown. Overlapping items. Okay, I have a post office now. I still don't have a hospital. I can't, can I even afford the giant hospital? I'm really, you guys, I don't think that you're you're speaking very clearly when you say this. This thing costs 1,880,000. I don't think it's a good idea to buy another, like I don't think that we should do that. Like we can get a hospital eventually, but I don't think that right now is the best time to get the giant hospital. <laughs> You know what we could get is a crematorium. So, hey DeLorean, thank you for the raid, it's good to see you. Park maintenance. Hmm. Should I get that? Then we can get like large parks. I want more parks. Oh. Are you? Do you fit? Oh my god, it's like just about too big for my grid. Oh boy. Maybe I'll put it over there. What is that? Should have read it first. Corundum condos. New signature building available. Okay, I wanna- I'm sorry, I keep not thinking about um, the trains. <laughs> no, Louise, I'm only streaming in the afternoon tomorrow. I usually stream in the morning on Wednesdays, um, but because I just was out of town, um, I have a lot of stuff that I need to do <laughs> and like uh, catch up with <laughs> and things. Um, so unfortunately I, I won't be able to stream tomorrow um, in the morning. I'll stream in the afternoon tomorrow instead only. Not investing in healthcare, I see. <laughs> Very American. <laughs> I know. Okay, should I start thinking about the train now? I've been putting it off. I need a rail yard. Where should I put this? Probably not nearby to that, huh? I need a road for this rail yard too. Does it matter, guys? I'm from America. I don't know much about trains. Does it need? To, does this need to be like close to my? Or what? Should I put it like? here. Overlapping items. Oh my god, grow up. Train station close to bus station. Well, this is the this is a rail yard for the storing, sorting and maintenance of trains. The train station is different. You think I should put the rail yard by the industrial area? This is different. This is not a train station, it's a rail yard. That's why I'm asking. Far away, okay. That's why I was like, you guys, are you sure about that? Maybe I'll buy some more land. Um, okay. People aren't gonna need to get down here as much, exactly. Um, maybe I'll put it like... Is that the railroad? It is. Okay, that's good. Um... Overlapping items. So, oh, the farm. Yeah, that is a problem, isn't it? Oh, so you can buy land, but not a hospital. Sounds like some billionaires I know. <laughs> um. Yeah. Overlapping items. It's because of the power line. Oh my God. Honestly, you have to die, sorry. Awkward. I just killed someone so I could build a rail yard. Does it have to be connected up in two ways? Oh my god, you guys, I think I messed up. 
I think it needs to be like, I think I want it to be like this. Okay, hold on. Oh God. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna buy this too. Okay, sorry, I got it, hold on. Um. Okay, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Um, stop, stop. Okay. Okay, okay. Now the road doesn't go anywhere. So that's no good. Um, I need to like watch someone else play with this so that I can be smart because I don't know what I'm doing. Come here. Is that fine? Listen, that might not be the most realistic thing in the world. I'm not sure that matters. I think it's actually fine. Curve too tight, okay. Curve too tight, uh oh. Doesn't connect. You guys, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm experimenting, it's fine. Okay. Okay. That's pretty good. This needs to get hooked up still to like everything else. Oh my God. <laughs> That's a zoo, look, what is that? <laughs> oh. This is a guinea pig city. That's a good way of putting it. Yeah, we're experimenting still. That's all that matters. Um. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. Did I choose a swamp on purpose? Hope, are you asking like if I picked a swamp because I'm from Florida? Because the answer is no, but um, maybe I should say yes. Well, that's hooked up. I don't think it's right, but <laughs> it's hooked up. <laughs> you know what it's not hooked up to? A uh, functional railroad, you know why? There's no railroad. Okay. Um, oh, you guys want more shops. You can have some of those. I can get you that. I probably should have put some, oh, you know what I should do is replace these houses because there's too much noise. I'm trying to like space it out better for you guys. The rail connection on the right of the asset isn't connected properly. Why? Oh. <laughs> oh, you mean the main rail connection? The one that connects it to everything else? Oh no. There we go. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> can we get another tile? Yeah, we can buy more tiles. We can get these. I think I would prefer, to be honest, to expand this way though. Cause this is where I want my like rest of the city to go. So it's fine. Shh, I don't wanna listen to you talk, sorry. Okay. The tiles smaller now? Yeah, I, th I think the tiles are smaller in this game. Am I making that up? Maybe I'm making it up. Could be wrong. Don't listen to a word I say, okay? Just in case. Pashti, we haven't had any FPS issues. I did, um, before I went live, I did adjust 
a couple settings based on what they had posted on Steam. Um, they had posted like a thingy on the Steam page with some tips to optimize performance. So I did that, like I did what they said there. Um, and I haven't had any problems. I know that there's been some reviews about uh, people having issues, but I, I don't know, I haven't had any problems. Um, so I, <laughs> I can't really speak to that from personal experience. Um, but I have, it's been running and fine for me at least. Okay, um, maybe I'll start putting some more residential over here. I don't know. Citizen happiness increased, okay. Is that straight? I don't think I, I don't know. Sorry, I know you just built that. So sorry, so sorry. Yikes, those are not straight at all. Fail. Um, maybe that's straight, okay. Ooh, an old style soda bar, okay. Should we put some more of those signature buildings in? I do have these condominium things. And I have this little square building. Oh, that's right. I was gonna put, um, I wanted this to be medium density, didn't I? We have some more over here too. That's cute. Okay, I like that. Shall I let it keep running for a while? I don't know. Okay, I have to build a train station. I still haven't done that. Where should the train station go? That's what I'm like not really sure about. Um, I think it would be nice to have a train station down where like some of the higher density stuff is like up here somehow, but we want to have probably a couple, I suppose. Okay. Do you think that we should put the train station like Um, I guess on this, I don't really know where I want to have the trains go. Um, what if we like broke up the grid a little bit? Hold on. <laughs> okay, hear me out. We're getting a little bit wild, everybody. <laughs> but what if we broke up the grid a little bit? And we put the train station like on a diagonal for fun. I don't know. Plus that would be easier for us to get the, the uh, tracks into. So I didn't flatten it. <sighs> Hold on. Hold on everybody. I'm gonna fix it. It's gonna be fine. <laughs> I think what I'll do probably is flatten it first, like, oh my. Okay. You flatten. Wish the worlds were already flat. Really? I, I, I think that sometimes it being not flat is fun, but other times, not so much. Um, I don't know. It's interesting, I guess. I, uh, you don't have to pay to do the terrain in this version of the game. You did in the old City Skylines, but not in this one, which to me is a massive improvement because this is like not really a problem now that you don't have to worry about paying for it. It was a bigger deal when you had to pay to do the terrain. So, okay. Well, that's cute. 
Let's call it, this is going to be Central Station. Okay. And you know what else we need? It's a station on this side of town as well. Um, what if we got like, I don't know. Never mind. Mediocre Central Station, not Grand Central Station. Yeah, you get it, exactly. <laughs> it's not a Grand Central Station, but it's a, it's a Central Station. <laughs> okay. Is there a smaller station? I don't think so. We have the cargo train terminal and we have the train station. It's kind of like only that though. Oh, should I put another park? You guys are like fine for parks. It's these people down here that are struggling. I'll give you one. Um, all right, where should I put it? Ew, look at my poo water. Oh my God, these people live right there. What was I thinking? <gasps> I'm sorry. Oh my God, I'm sorry. You can, oh my God, you don't have to be there anymore. Oh, well. Oh, specialized industry. We have so many more options now. Well, I guess maybe I will let them live there. Never mind. I'll let you stay there. I could dezone it, but eh. You can live by the poop. I don't care. <laughs> Somebody's gotta. Somebody's gotta. Okay. Um. What are you mad about? Not enough customers? Really? Oh no. Okay. Okay. Um, oh, shoot. Let's just flatten this a little bit more. And then we'll try to like, smooth it out and build some more low density housing up here. Yeah, I would prefer to not imagine the smell actually. That's disgusting. <laughs> I'm trying not to think about it actually. <laughs> That is just gross. Um, a slope too steep, really? I guess it is quite steep, huh? Can you come up from down here? Slope too steep? Slope's not too bad from here. No, it is. Okay. <gasps> Never mind. Ignore that, okay? Sorry. What I will do is get some more houses in here, though. That'll be good. Kill you broke the ground. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't do a very good job of this. Yeah, the autumn trees look really nice, don't they? It's pretty. Boom town. Oh, we got loads more money. That's good. What did we get? Heavy traffic ban, advanced pollution management. Wow. We got almost 6,000 people living here. That's pretty good. Yeah, I love that there's seasons in this game. I think it's quite cool how there's like real seasons in here. <sighs> okay, focus on the train station situation, Kayla. Um, do you think that it would be so weird of me to build a train station like down here. Kinda, I might have to swap these to not be like low density housing anymore, but maybe having the train station, oh my God. <laughs> maybe having the train station down here um, and we could get like a, maybe like a pedestrian thing to hook it up for these people and then the students have access to it quite easily. I think that makes sense. They do want some more medium density, so maybe I'll swap these out. And now they need more low density again. Oh God. Okay, um, do you think that the train should tunnel?
Oh, that's so weird. I didn't mean like that. I was just looking, but that, okay. Um, I think the train tunneling a little bit makes sense because the, the slope is so high. But. Okay. 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 Um. Oh my god. Let's just start by... Build oh no, I didn't mean for you to be tunneled either. Oh my god, you guys, I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> I like the idea of the tunnel though. I think that's cool. And then we can try and build a big page up. That's flat, yes. Okay. Is there still a tunnel there? I don't know. Don't care. Um, okay. These will all like converge into one line. Are there metros in this game? Yeah, there are metros in this game. Um, you can in fact build like a subway system. Um, I am building an obviously an over like above the ground train at the moment, but um, there are subways. There's even like trams and stuff too. There's a whole, you can do ferries. There's so much like really cool public transportation in, uh, in cities. I obviously don't have them unlocked, but there's trams, subways, uh, water with ships and stuff, and there's also air travel. Okay. You know who doesn't have ferries? The Sims 4. Different kind of ferries, though. Oh. I'm using the wrong kind of train track. I wanna upgrade it all to be double train track. That's way better. Dang, okay, sorry. Anyway, <laughs> this game's got seasons in the base game too. You know who can't relate? The Sims 4. You're saying fairies, thought you were saying fairies. Yeah, that was the, that was kind of the joke I was making is that they both are said the same by me, at least. Um, it's kind of silly, but. Okay, let's try that again now that I have this better set up. I can build a lovely double track and then I'll get, well, I guess, Okay, fine. This is not very curved nicely. <gasps> Oops, sorry. Oh my God, I made to delete the whole thing. My bad. All right. We can curve that a little bit prettier. Yay, okay. Okay. So that's all hooked up to this. We need to get a train in to the city. Um, okay. Oh no, that wasn't what I wanted. Um, oh my God, you guys. <laughs> Where can we put the equestrian center? All right, hope. No room for horse girls in this house. Um, shall I get some more of the medium density stuff going on in some of these areas? They don't really want any of the um, office buildings that I've put. Yeah, I don't think there's horses in this game. Hope was trying to make a silly little joke. Um, oh, what are you guys? What's wrong with you? Air pollution? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I probably shouldn't have, I probably shouldn't have any of this zoned. 
Huh. Okay. Eh, they'll be fine. Maybe the horse, maybe the pop star did have horses in the back. I'm not sure. <gasps> Hope! Oh my god, the pop star has horses! No, you're right. The pop star does have horses. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> Let me just save again. Overwrite it, yeah. There is horses at the pop star's house. We were calling this Taylor's house, but yeah, they do have horses out there. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Okay, what was I gonna do? Oh my god, we need more industry so bad too. Can I try and get myself like a farm again? Cause I had to... Does that help cover any of it? I don't know. Oh, I like this street with these houses on it. I think that's so interesting. Okay. Um, sorry. Back to the- Oh, look how much more industry we need! Uh, never mind, it went down a little bit. Oh, it's back up. Should I try to- Okay. Okay. Overlapping items? Is there something that I need there that I can't- I don't know. I'm really bad at planning industrial spaces. I don't like, I think I just don't want them. Um, and that's part of the problem. <laughs> I simply don't care about them. So I just, I don't know. Okay, let's put some more low density housing out here too. And then I'll go back to the train again. But what about the jobs? I know. They need they need jobs. It's okay. I'm sorry. I will I will give them industry, I swear. I promise. I will do this for you, my little city friends. Oh, now you want offices? What the heck? Okay. Um where did I Maybe I'll try and replace some of these with offices. Some of these too. I don't know. Obviously I understand that you need industry. I just don't like things that pollute. Guys, I'm not, I know how the game works. <laughs> the purple is office buildings, yeah. Um, they're asking for them. We'll see if they actually use them. You don't really need, I probably put too many to be honest. You really don't need that much. Mixed housing, commercial space on the bottom and apartments on top, that's so cool. Oh, I love that. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. I was gonna do my train over here, okay. Um, I started my tunnel already. So I think what I will do is I will have them connect up to one tunnel. No. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, we'll try and connect it up to this tunnel space here. Are those not hooked up? What the heck? Let me try that again. Um, slope too steep? Really? Well, that one's fine. Oh my, okay.
Besties, that looks terrible. Just ignore it though, okay? <laughs> Just ignore it, it's fine. Uh, I guess... Come up. Like that. It's not connected? I thought I... Oh, it's still not connected. Why does it keep not connecting? I thought I connected it. I'm confused. Is it just saying that because I haven't connected it to anything else yet? Is that why it's doing that? Oh my god. 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 I hate this. I need to... Get go under. Oh, that's the wrong kind of under. Oh my god, I'm actually wasting so much money and time doing this. They're one way tracks. These? I don't think they are. There's two sides of them. So. Need to re click them. Oh, you think? Come in, hook up. Hook up. Oh, maybe I won't try and do this today. Um. How is that not connected still? Does it need to go out farther? Is that the problem? I need to like have it not go. I'm gonna try and mess with the ground. I can't, I'm like, I don't wanna deal with this right now. <laughs> it seems like it shouldn't, It's. I'm like thinking about it too much. Um, I think it might need to have a section on the ground like this and then have it start tunneling. But even so, we could probably have it just not do that anymore. How about a hospital instead? We can afford a hospital now. We can afford a hospital now. But look, um, there's things that I need to zone. Guess I'll just do that instead. <laughs> well, that's a park. I can't zone that as a... Is that like one piece of big road? Why? Huh. Sorry, everyone, hold on. Yeah, we can't afford a hospital now though. Maybe I'll put it over here. I also can get the crematorium. Oh. <gasps> oh God. Oh. Oh god, there's a crime scene right there. The purple is office buildings. Yeah. Um wow, I think I over I think I overdid that. I really don't think we needed that hospital right now, but everybody's been yelling about it this whole time, so Maybe I'll get a crematorium. Oh, this is like way bigger in this game than it was in the old one. That is so interesting. It used to be quite small if you remember correctly. That's nice. Yeah, I mean, I guess it's fine if the crime scene is across from the hospital, you know? <laughs> I guess there's worse places for it to be. <laughs> okay. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. I should probably get off stream here soonish as well. I could literally sit here and play City Skylines all night. It's cool how far the, the city has come though. We have like 8,000 people living in it. We've been losing money this entire time, which is not that good. Um, we have too much service upkeep. But, I don't know. I'll play again this week. Yeah, I think what I would like to do is play again on, um, so on Thursday, I'm gonna stream until midnight 
because of the Taylor Swift album that's coming out. <laughs> I want to uh, I want to stream until the Taylor Swift album drops. So um, I think that's what I will do. <laughs> and I might play um, I might play City Skylines again on Thursday night because I'm having fun. I really love City Skylines so much. This game, I'm sure a lot of you know this about me because I literally talk about it all the time, but this is like one of my favorite games of all time to watch people play. I just I am so fascinated by it. I know that I'm not that good at it. Um, so for that, I apologize. <laughs> um, but I, I just think that it's really fun. Obviously, it just came out the new one today. Thanks again to City Skylines for sponsoring the stream as well, because I was going to play this anyway. Um, so <laughs> I really, really appreciate it. It's been really cool that they sponsored. If you want to check it out, we do have a link in the chat as well um, uh, where we, you can download it and stuff. Um, but don't tell them that yet. Yeah, shh. You didn't have to pay me, but you did. <laughs> Um, Taylor's re-recording of 1989 comes out this week. Um, so if you, you probably are familiar with 1989. That's probably the album that most of you are like the most familiar with. It's the Shake It Off album. Um, so I, I figure, oh, I shouldn't be like triple speeding. Um, I figure a lot of you probably know, know that one. <laughs> but the re-recording, the Taylor's version comes out this week. So I'm really looking forward to it. Um, and I'm gonna stream until midnight when it drops. Um, Cause I'm just excited. Anyway, um, I think it's the best album, The Oldies, No Hesitation. Really? I, I like it. Um, I like it. It's a good one. Um, let me put the, the link in the chat for you guys again, too, if you want to check it out. Um, and then I think on that note, I'm sorry to run, but um, I do have, uh, I need to go to the grocery store tonight is the problem. Because I just got back from TwitchCon and I have no food in the house. <laughs> so I do have to go. <laughs> um, Among Us, we're going to play. Yeah, so um, it's a big week for games because this game came out today. Uh, the new Among Us map came out today as well. We're playing Among Us on Thursday um, with our Sims friends. We're going to uh, do our little Halloween Among Us on Thursday. So we have that to look forward to. And then I'm also going to play Sims this week, obviously. We're going to do some Sims 4 building tomorrow. I usually stream in the mornings on Wednesdays. I won't be here in the morning tomorrow just because I have too much work to do. Um, so I will be here in the afternoon. <laughs> um, but we'll, we'll be here at like this time tomorrow, um, basically is the plan. All right, well, thank you all for hanging out. I will, uh, I guess, catch you all tomorrow. Thank you again to City Skylines for sponsoring the stream. Oh, you just got here. I'm so sorry. I would stream this all night if I did not have so much to do. And this is the problem with it coming out right after TwitchCon is that I'm like, I'm so busy because I just got back from being out of town for like five days. <laughs> But it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> uh, we'll go and find someone to raid who's also maybe playing this game. I'm not sure who all is live. Oh, I know. I know. I know. I know. One of my dearest friends, uh, Rochella, she's also playing City Skylines. I think she's better at it than me, so we can go watch her play it. Um, but she's also playing right now. Uh, and I just got back from seeing her at TwitchCon, so that's going to be kind of fun. We'll go watch We'll go watch Shella play some cities as well. Um, have a wonderful rest of your evening, everyone. Um, thank you for hanging out. I will catch you tomorrow. Um, I wish I could play this all night. <laughs> and I will see you all tomorrow. Okay, okay. Who needs groceries? Just keep playing. You know what? Maybe you're right. I might play off stream a little bit tonight though. I might make, I might like, I have a deep desire to play a sandbox city with like cheats, um, just to like see and do everything. I know that's bad, but that's my dream. <laughs> I have a deep desire to do a sandbox city. So I don't know, maybe I will, we'll see. <laughs> maybe when I get back. Um, but then I'll, I'll learn so much from that. So when we play again on Thursday, I'll be like an expert. Okay, I'll think about it. Okay, anyway, thank you for hanging out. <laughs> um, and I'll catch you all tomorrow, okay? Good night, everybody. I'll see you later. Bye.